Hey guys, so I'm here just kind of following up on my last video on how I do my keto friendly meal prep. I'm just going to give you guys a quick just preview of what I'm preparing for lunch tomorrow. I already, I had dinner at 9 because I actually started eating at 1 since I was fasting so tomorrow I'll fast to 12 and I will be bringing with me to work a salad I have my lettuce tomatoes um, I got some peppers red yellow these are sweet which is really good and um, I'm not doing too much with the salad um, you know besides just having like veggies but I'm, of course I'm gonna add some blue cheese um, crumbs here crumble cheese and of course my olive oil I have here and I've been going back and forth with the apple cider vinegar that I used with the oil and I'm also using a little bit of balsamic vinegar so as you can see I'm running out so I kind of use a little bit between those two and then I take with me my pink um, sea salt um, it comes it's a grinder so you can use it because they say that this is really good to use and I'm just going to cut everything up and put it in here. So for my protein, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use some chicken that I have bought from Publix. Baked chicken because, you know, like I said, I'm busy. I'm on the go. Um, it's late, so I'm kind of prepping this so that I don't have to worry about what I'm going to eat and then get stressed out because I don't have, you know, food or worry about eating out and they don't, they're not utilizing the ingredients that are keto friendly. So I have a scale that I used when I used to do Weight Watchers. Remember I told you I eat, did everything <laughs> to lose weight. So um, because I want to keep my protein um, on you know anywhere between four to five or maybe the most six ounces, what I do is that I utilize um, just a foam. It doesn't weigh much. So as you can see, how the scalp is on zero, and if I put the plate on it, it doesn't really add much. Um, so if I put this whole chicken with the skin on it, it's nine um, ounces. So I'm going to cut this, and my hands are clean, by the way. Plus, this is my lunch. <laughs> um, and it's at 6.7, which is not that bad. But like I said, I'm trying to really be clean about this and um, stick, you know, you know to it so it's exactly the six pounds right now so that's what I will eat for lunch with all of my greens veggies tomatoes that I was showing you guys before and then of course my crumbled cheese which you know adds in um, that good you know good fat that that they always talking about I usually add a little bit of avocado but I don't have any today I have to go shopping for that but this will be lunch and then for dinner what I will do is because again I will fast I'm going to just incorporate maybe the last pieces of the chicken that I have um, I'll put that I will weigh that to see how much that is um, it's not enough it's only three ounces so I need you know three more ounces um, to make it a full meal so I'll add you know some more chicken in there to make it a full six and I have that with some warm veggies either broccoli or I do some spinach um, and I just pretty much add a little bit of butter and that will be my dinner for tomorrow so now you see pretty much you know just a little bit of what I put together um, I try to make it simple I like to do like those recipes that we were talking about earlier during the weekends when I have more time to explore but during the week I try to make it simple because you know time doesn't always work on my side with the baby school work husband you know household so I try to just make sure that I have what I need when I leave um, I have actually a lunch bag. I put everything right here in this lunch bag and I'm good to go because when I leave tomorrow after I drop my daughter off at the daycare in the morning I won't come back till maybe nine o'clock because I will be at work and then from there straight to school. Um, so you know by the time I come home it's time to go to bed so I pack everything that I need right here which will be two meals I don't do any snacks I drink a lot of water and what I do with my water is just add lemon and minty leaf that I get I rinse them up and I put it in just for a little bit of flavor so that I don't feel like I'm drinking water with no taste and it actually works it's pretty good so this is kind of like one of my routines I'll share with you any you know anything else that I have coming up thank you so much for watching 
Don't forget to share, comment, like, and subscribe.